Paris is one of the world's most popular tourist destinations, but it's allegedly being inundated by some unwelcome visitors. Bedbugs crawling in public transport and some cinemas, hotels and homes. You see, there's maybe even 15 of them and a lot of really tiny ones. With less than a year until the Paris Olympic Games, the French government's under pressure to eradicate them. We have to take each case seriously and not fall into panic. We need to make it clear that there is no upsurge, but we are responding and checking each case. Some people, though, are taking no chances. Sales of anti-bedbug products in the city have risen by 30%. It's true that we've been hearing a lot about it on the radio and TV, so I prefer to buy the products and prepare my flat just in case. It's not only Parisians who are worried about bedbugs. Some international visitors are also concerned about what they might take home. Among them, thousands of rugby fans who are in France for the World Cup. I'd be concerned. Uh, we just need to keep an eye out, I suppose. I, I'd be uh, a bit reluctant to be sitting on seats where I don't need to be sitting. So, stand on the metro. <laughs> I'm pretending it's not happening because our hotel's fine right now. So, But we have had a friend from home text us and ask us whether um, we've seen bed bugs. Bed bugs are nocturnal and live off human blood. Their bites cause itching. Scientists say washing textiles in high temperatures, using steam and vacuuming can get rid of them. If you do this methodically and meticulously, you've decontaminated your room in just one morning. As French authorities step up their battle against bed bugs, the hope is the people in Paris will be able to sleep tight and not let the bed bugs bite. Natasha Butler, Al Jazeera, Paris. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.